Hi, everybody. We'll wait a few seconds for people to start rolling in before we get started. So thank you for being with us today and we'll get started here soon. <clears throat> okay, we'll go ahead and get started. Good afternoon and welcome to, to today's webinar, Love Your Guests and Don't Lose Your AC, presented by Mitch Cook with Spearcorp. My name is Ben Noor and I'm the Partnership Development Manager for the Texas Restaurant Association. I'd like to introduce Mitch Cook, the CEO of Spear. Spear is a leading provider of energy management solutions for commercial buildings and facilities across the United States. Spear is also the preferred partner for all energy management solutions and off solutions offered to our members at a discounted rate. Mitch, welcome to today's webinar and thank you for being with us. Is it correct that your family has been a uh, company owned for over 50, 50 years and that it was started by your father and now you, your brothers and sons carrying on the fam fam family legacy? Uh, yeah, that's that's correct, Ben. Thanks for having us. Yeah, we were. Uh, it's kind of ironic that uh, today's environment is like it was when Dad started the company back in 1972. You you had the energy crisis. People were waiting in line for gas and all this stuff, and and the cost of utilities was skyrocketing. It's the same thing that's going on today, and you know we've been dealing with it for over almost 50 years now. Wow. That is a long time and it shows the longevity of your company and how well you all have been successful. So our webinar topic today is a very important issue for all restaurateurs. As we know, Texas is experiencing some very hot temperatures, especially as of late. <clears throat> and if your air conditioners malfunction or parts go out, then it could create a bad situation for your guests and staff. What can restaurants do now to be proactive in making sure that they are ready for hot temperatures this summer in their restaurants? Well, you know, they need to, maintenance everything just like their cars um, you don't get on a road go on a road trip before you you know look at the tires and change the oil and all that stuff the same thing goes with the ac here in texas for the summer you need to make sure that everything's maintenanced uh, because proper maintenance on your equipment is going to keep it going and the longevity of the equipment and it's going to help you be energy efficient Great. Well, I look forward to uh, hearing about other ways that restaurateurs can to prevent their AC from breaking. And um, that being said, I do want to mention there will be a Q&A at the end of this presentation. So if you have any questions, just drop them in the chat and then I'll be sure to ask Mitch at the end. And that being said, Mitch, I'm going to pass it off to you and let you get this thing started. Uh, thanks. Thanks, Ben. Uh, like I said, uh, Temsco is family owned and operated. Um, we've been in business since 1972. Uh, we put a little slideshow presentation together to uh, let you guys explore and understand what we can do to help you and your facilities. Uh, go ahead and hit next slide, please. <clears throat> so we've developed a program called Spears Energy Shield Program. Um, it gives TRA members a $75 hour rate for labor on any repair, whether it's mechanical, electrical, kitchen equipment, uh, um, anything to do with your facility. Um, we do have priority service calls, um, six hours or less if it's a, um, a priority, such as a walk-in cooler or freezer or a kitchen unit, something that, that re, um, requires food safety. Um, in this program, when we put in new equipment, the equipment is covered under warranty for the life of the program. Uh, all our repairs that we do inside the program are one year warranty. So we actually track each individual repair and you'll know when we installed it and, and repaired it and you'll have the, the item. So that way, six months, eight months down the road, if that same item fails, it's under warranty. Um, with our energy management systems, we have real time alarm responses, meaning that if you had a cooler or a freezer go out, um, we'll be calling you and we'll be proactive before, you know, one of your employees walks into uh, the cooler and realizes that it's hot and you've lost all your product. Um, we also install new LED lights. 
uh, replacement uh, of these lights while they're in the warrant or in the program are completely no cost to you. Um, we install the energy management system. Uh, we have flexible terms and payments on everything. And we also work with the TRA EF uh, to help contribute funds uh, to that uh, organization. One of the things that I wanna talk about first is that everybody knows that the cost of energy is going up. We have a national account, a large restaurant national account that they were paying 6.2 cents per kwh last year at this time and we track all of the all of our customers electric bills we get them every single month they are now paying 10.2 cents so in a matter of a year their rate has gone up 74.6 percent in one year and there's nothing anybody can do about it except two things energy efficiency energy control and that's what we do that's what our program does is it gives you the ability to have all this equipment and all new equipment great curb appeal and we do it at no upfront cost to you so a little bit more about our energy shield program the goal of the program is very simple we want you to save more money on your maintenance and your utility cost than what you pay for our program so basically the difference falls to your profit line. So what, what that being said, you're gonna save on your energy bills because we're gonna control the energy usage and we're gonna make it more efficient by uh, making the proper repairs and doing the maintenance on your facilities. It's just like your car, like I spoke before. If you don't take care of your car, it's gonna break down. If you don't take care of it, it's gonna get poor gas mileage. Same thing with your equipment at your facility. So we have flexible payment terms. You can pay upfront 100% cash. You can pay 50% cash and then make monthly payments or you can just make all monthly payments or you can pay off individual line items in our program. So for example, if we put in you know, five LED lights and then a new rooftop units and you wanted to pay off the five LED lights one month, good. That means that you, you get all those savings. Uh, so our job is to make sure that you keep your profits. And this is not a contract that you sign up for that you're locked into for 10 or 15 years. You can cancel this at any time. You just need to pay off the remaining balance and, and you're out of the contract. Um, we can add service work to it. Uh, there's With that, so if you had a, uh, let's say a compressor go down and that's a pretty costly repair, uh, don't worry about it. We'll come out there and replace the compressor, put it in the program. You can make the monthly payments, pay it off or pay half, whatever you want. So after 12 months of something being in the program, the balance automatically begins to depreciate. So you're not going to be paying today or what you're not going to be paying for something you put in today at the same price five years from now. That price is going to depreciate. Um, so this will allow you guys to keep everything up and running maintain your curb appeal because just like if your ice machine went down your customers are going to be upset because they don't have ice and we can eliminate all those issues for you by just simply joining our program uh, next slide please all right i'm going to talk a little bit about our energy management system ems so we install controls on all the rooftop units and you can think of the controls as like a thermostat on steroids. We can do a lot of different things with it to help maintain energy efficiency. But what we're gonna do is we're gonna put in a space sensor and that's gonna go where your thermostat is. Um, and then we're gonna turn it, put in a return air and a supply air sensor. And just those three items alone, we will be able to remotely monitor your, your air conditioning and determine if it's actually working properly or not. And why is this important? Well, a lot of times if you've got multiple locations, you get a call from the, the manager or the district manager and they say, hey, we're hot. Well, uh, are, is it broken or is it just somebody came in with a sweater on and it's 100 degrees outside? So with that and us being able to monitor it remotely, we can determine if the unit is working properly and save you a service call. So we also install the uh, master control panel and the lighting control panel. Now, the master control panel brings in the outside light levels, like, kind of like a you would see a photographer walking around 
you know, measuring light level. We actually read the outside light level, and that's important. I'll get to that in a minute. Uh, outside air temperature, we monitor the walk-in coolers and freezers. And all this can be communicated to you, either text message or email. You can get into your restaurant and your facility with any smart device. You'll get nar alarm notifications. And then we can also schedule your, your building properly. So the lighting control <coughs> aspect of it, we're gonna control all the lights in the facility inside and out. Now, if you really sit down and you think about this, you got your work lights in your kitchen, you got your bathroom lights, the manager's office, you got your, your dining room lights, you got your road signs, you got your parking lot lights, you got you know, your, your landscape lighting. And here's the problem with all that. If you just turn all of them on at one time, it's like stepping on the gas full, you know, hard on your, uh, in your car, you're gonna lower your, um, your gas mileage. And so what the idea is, and we'll take just the outside lights, for example. Now, we're monitoring the outside light level. So as it gets to a certain point, we're going to turn certain lights on. So, for example, the first thing we're going to turn on is the most important thing. We're going to turn the, the signs on, the building signs, uh, the road sign. And then 10 minutes later, you know, when it gets a little darker, we're going to turn on the building lights, which are the you know, the wall sconces and, and, and the landscape lighting. And then finally, when it gets dark enough, we're gonna turn on the big lights, which is the parking lot lights. And why that's important is that we stage these things up over a matter of 30 minutes. And electricity works just like gas mileage. So the more you bring into your facility at one time, that's that demand charge that you see on your electric bill. That's what drives up that demand. And so by staging it on, we're not driving that demand up. So that's how the energy management system works. And when we put this thing in, it's under warranty uh, for the life, life of the Energy Shield program. Uh, next slide, please, please. Uh, my favorite, <laughs> energy efficient LED lighting. Um, you know, I'll just give you an example. Uh, the old lot lights that they put in five, 10 years ago, the metal halides are a thousand watt bulbs. And I see a lot of them still out there in the parking lot. The new LED lights are 135 watts and they're brighter and they make things look much nicer. Not only that, is there about an 82 to 85% reduction in uh, usage by just changing those lights alone. Then you start adding in your kitchen lights that are burning all the time, uh, your, your decorative lights in your dining room, changing all these things out. That is just a given. There's no, uh, it's it's hard numbers. You're going from one high wattage down to a, a lower wattage. And that's where we save energy with that. Now, when we put these LED lights in, in our uh, energy shield program, if any of them ever go out, we come out and change them at no cost to you. Uh, next slide, please. Oh, great. Um, rooftop units, uh, air conditioning units. Uh, if everybody knows that like, you had a, 1990 Chevy truck, it got three miles to the gallon and you went and bought a 2022 Chevy truck, uh, it's getting 22 to 25 miles to the gallon. Same thing with air conditioners. The older AC units that you have have a lower SEER rating. Uh, they're not as energy efficient. Uh, a lot of them probably have had a lot of Band-Aids uh, added to them to keep them running. And, and what I say about Band-Aids is the more Band-Aids that you add to a problem, the more surgery costs to actually fix it. So what we recommend is just replacing air conditioning units and putting in the new energy efficient ones, uh, putting them inside the energy shield program. They'll be under warranty for the life of the program. So if you have it for you know 10 years in the program, hey, that unit is under warranty the entire time. We also install new refrigeration equipment for coolers and freezers. We can actually install new coolers and freezers for you. Um, and then all the repairs that we do have a one year warranty uh, for units that you guys currently have in place. Uh, next slide, please. We can also install energy efficient kitchen equipment. And my example of this is, I know certain chefs like their certain equipment, you know, some guys like the Fry Master and some guys like, you know, a, a different uh, manufacturer for their fryer. We're not gonna recommend anything that you are not currently using but we're gonna recommend that you bring in the more, more efficient model. Um, 
it's very simple. They come in uh, warranty, and, and that way you, you don't have you have peace of mind that that equipment is going to continue to run uh, for the next 10, 15 years because it, it is an investment. Uh, same thing on the kitchen repair. Um, any repair is under a, a one-year warranty. Okay, next slide, please. Preventative maintenance. This is huge because, there, like I said, there's two ways to be energy efficient. You have to have energy control, and then you have to be energy efficient. So the control comes in with the energy management system control and the usage. The efficiency comes in with the new units, the new LED lights, but the big piece of that is preventative maintenance and, and having a scheduled preventative maintenance and sticking with it. Because the more you stick with it, the longer your equipment is going to last, the quicker we can fix a minor issue before it becomes a major issue. And that's the thing about keeping the maintenance costs low for your facilities is catching the issues before they become a huge issue and a huge expenditure for you. Uh, like I said, $75 rate on all repairs, uh, six hour re response time on priority calls, um, you know, coolers, freezers, kitchen, HVAC, uh, notification of on-site management of any concerns or issues that we found. And this is a big thing. I, me and my brothers are absolute freaks about customer service. We want to be as transparent as possible. So when you're in our preventative maintenance program, we're gonna send you before and after pictures, before we clean the units and then after we clean the units. Cause we wanna be as transparent as possible. We're gonna take pictures of any issues that we find and we're gonna bring them to you and say, hey, this is what we found up on your roof because you may have not been up on that roof in six to eight months because there's never been an issue. So we wanna be as transparent as possible and make sure that you guys understand that we're here to help and not to just sell service calls because that's not what we do. We want to partner with our customers for them to be as energy as efficient as possible so that you can take what you're spending on energy and maintenance and put that in your bottom line. Uh, next slide, please. So here's our service checklist and I'm not going to go through it all. It's, it's, you can get to us, it's, it's out there on the website, but basically everything is going to be checked on this checklist every single time. And this goes back to the before and after pictures and you'll get notification prior to us arriving. You'll get notification after we finished. You'll get the checklist, you'll get the before and after pictures. And this is a huge thing uh, to make sure that everybody understands what's going on in their facilities. Next slide, please. Uh, for more information about us, you can contact us through the TRA website, which I have behind me, um, or you can directly uh, contact us at info at spearcorp.com. Now, before I, I turn it back over to you, Ben, I, I want to make an offer to everybody that's online. If you email us or, or contact us and you tell us that you were on the webinar today on 621 and you're a TRA member, what we're going to do is... Normally it's about 100 to $120 an air conditioning unit to, to perform preventative maintenance on it. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna do one unit at full cost and the second unit at half cost. So if you have four air conditioning units, we're gonna charge you for only three of them. So we wanna do this because we wanna make sure that you're, op you're open and serving your customers and that they've got a great environment and you've got a nice shiny location for them to come into because that's the name of the game is making sure that from the road or when they get inside, they're welcome. They know exactly that your, your facility is top notch because they're comfortable, it's fully lit. So we wanna make sure that we can get you there. And by giving you this offer, that'll also send our um, site survey specialist out and he'll do a complete site survey at no cost to you and tell you everything that we can do to save you energy and save on your maintenance cost. Great, Mitch, thank you for that. That was very informative and that, was, that is a very generous offer. Uh, before I address a couple of questions that we have in the chat, I would like to run through some questions maybe that we didn't get to address throughout the presentation. Sure. As we know, uh, supply chain issues are out there. What are some ways <laughs> or some, some tips that restaurateurs can avoid to be stuck in that very long supply chain? Oh, wow, um, man, I'm gonna tell you, uh, 
it's it's tough right now. It's tough getting air conditioning units. Um, one major manufacturer is no longer shipping them this this year. Um, so the, the thing that we can rec recommend the most is the preventative maintenance aspect of it, so that we can get out there or anybody can get out there and go through the units and make sure that they find the small problem before it becomes a big problem. Because, you know, getting compressors or new air conditioning units, are, um, it's, it's not like it was last year or the year before where you just call up and they, they ship it. It's like, hey, you know, you'll get it when we get it <laughs> type deal. So the main thing is just to make sure that you do your preventative maintenance on everything. Yep. And that includes ice machines and coolers and freezers and not only just the walk-ins, but the reach-ins and all that other good stuff too. Okay, great. <clears throat> we did have a, a few questions in the chat that I'd like to like to bring up and you may have already answered this in the, the offer that you just gave out to the people on the call. Does Spear, can Spear visit restaurants to do an evaluation on energy efficiency? Oh, absolutely. And we do it at no cost. And it, it, our energy our site surveys that you we do, you'll get every light bulb you have, every model number for your cooking equipment, what you have for refrigeration, reach-in, walk-ins. Uh, you'll have um, your ice machines, your drink machines. Uh, you know what, how tall your sign is, um, and and the recommendations. And usually these things come at about they're twenty to twenty-five pages long, and it takes us probably about three depending on the size, anywhere from three hours to two days, depending on how big the restaurant is. Okay, that's great. Um, a follow-up question to that, what is the onboarding process to become a customer of Spear? Well, you can go to the TRA website and go and then follow our link, or you can go to info at spearcorp.com and uh, just tell us what you need. And you know, if it's a simple repair to begin with, or you want us to come out and and uh, do our maintenance package, uh, we can do that. And then we'll give you a proposal for the Energy Shield program based upon what we find in our site survey. And then it's as simple as you you sign the document and, you know, uh, like I said, there's no upfront cost. Great. Well, then the, I'm speaking in third, in third language here. Well, so someone is asking if they would have access to the monitoring system or is that only monitored by Spear? Oh, absolutely, they'll have access. Okay. So they'll be able to get on their phone and change set points and change temperatures uh, or see if a repair was performed and it is still working properly because we monitor and log all the temperatures for the coolers, the freezers, and the air conditioning units. Okay. And, and so I, they can they can see that log. Right. And I assume that they would get notified if a temperature drops above a certain or goes above oh. a certain degree. Absolutely. And, and one of the good things about this is if you know, let's talk about a walk in freezer for a second. Everybody knows that a truck comes, the truck comes at a certain day, at a certain time, you know, maybe two or three times a week. So what our system is capable of is we put in a truck schedule. So if the truck comes on Mondays at two o'clock in the afternoon, we know that Mondays from two o'clock to four o'clock, if you get a high temp alarm in the freezer, it's not valid because they're stock in the freezer. And so the owners can have us make those changes for the truck schedule by just simply sending us an email or they can make those changes themselves. Mm -hmm. Well, Mitch, that covers all the questions. I know this is very useful for our members out there, especially as we're approaching the summer months, even though it surely feels that summer is here and it quickly got here but we just surpassed hot. it is hot so i know this, <laughs> this 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 webinar will go a long way and i do want to mention before we wrap up for those that are on this call um we do make this available on our website spears website it will be posted on our facebook and youtube so if you would like to share this with your colleagues please do um we, we i hope you find this useful uh before we wrap up mitch um, again, we can't thank you enough for your time today. We are excited that Spear is our newest preferred partner. Um, and just to confirm, you all will be at the Texas Restaurant Show, correct? Oh, we wouldn't miss it. Yeah, we're going to be there. We're going to be at uh, the Lone Star Bash. We're going to be at uh, in our booth is 1626. So everybody come by and see us. Come by and see me. I, I like to talk, as you can tell. Um, <laughs> I want to thank you guys, Ben. You guys have been great to work with. Um, all the members of the TRA are absolutely awesome. Um, we are so excited uh, to be partnered up with everybody and to help them, you know, put more 
profits on their bottom line by our expertise. Great, Mitch. Well, I, I'm sure you all can do that. I know Spear, you would be in great hands if you chose Spear as your uh, energy management solution provider. So Mitch, I can't thank you enough today and um, looking forward to seeing you at the show. All right, thanks, Ben. You guys okay. have a good one. Take care, everybody. Bye-bye.